peasants. Maybe if I collect their heads. Ooh, what the hell? The swamp clutches at your every step, so wanting you to stay, it is. Uh, while your boots sink into the mire, Alfred turns and suddenly heaves, adding his breakfast to the bog. You turn to see another brother in the distance double over, losing from his mouth a great spoo that has you choking back some vomit yourself. The easy company express their collective discomfort as more men wretch and gag. This truly is not, is no place for men to be. They're sick. Damn this place. Okay, you know what? Let's get out of here. That's no good. Can you actually see how or what? Six. Holy moly, that's horrible. Yeah, we need to get these men out. Spending a little bit too much time in the bog. We could get some fresh supplies over at uh, Glansburg here. Swampy region offer little food, but pickled mushrooms are a favoured provision for travellers in these areas. Still got fish. We'll uh, get some more grain and some mushrooms then. Where would be a good way of, or a good place to look for more bandits? Treat of the puppet mancer. Uh, the, that's the necromancer, apparently. Puppet master. Necromancer has made his lair. This lair is refuge for practicing dark rituals undisturbed. We are at the very edge of the known world here. Moving either, uh, even further might actually make us fall off it because. The world is as we know it, flat. Let's go check this out along the coastline. There really might just be... It's two more days. Let's just go ahead and collect it then. It's not the greatest of prizes, but it'll have to do. You return to Sir Eswig von Perrowinde. He is met with curiosity. He is counting crowns, but before giving you any, asks you how many heads you collected in your journey. After reporting eight kills, he purses his lips and nods. Good enough. The man spills some crowns into a satchel and hands it over. Well, if it wasn't enough, he wouldn't pay me, is that it? Hey, Cadis. I'm alright. How are you today? I was actually for a moment considering not doing this, but instead doing um, uh, Fallout 4 because the new patch has arrived, or well, updates, not patched, and the new DLC even. But I might do that tomorrow. I'm going to have to start repairing some of these things because I've got so much stuff and I need to sell it for some good coin. These are probably not going to be worth anything. So let's not even bother. Anything else that needs repairing? Not really. Just toss these out. Really? The disruptor has been buffed. Huh. I didn't realize it needed a buff. How did they buff it? Ooh, I might actually go and bring that to that place of north and set it over there because they're paying pretty coins for this. 
Anything else that I need from this place? Probably not. You know what? We'll take these. I need to get myself uh, a smithy. Weapons or armor smith. Doesn't really matter. We're, um... You know what? No, we're just going to move along. I think it was Glansburg. Where they're paying good coin for those uh, ember shards. They are ember shards, right? Yes, ember shards. Weapons only do standard damage to the drones. Oh, okay. So it's harder for the enemies to take them out then. What have they got over here that I need? Let's get some fruit and berries. My guys are probably still sick, aren't they? Yeah, they're still sick. Moving your guys through the bog is not good. It is to be avoided, as we have learned the hard way. And this place is... Well, there's not a lot going on here. Apart from some grave robbers and undead. But no bandits on the road. It's so very quiet. Although, I guess that would be a good thing. Dawn, very good. We arrive at Myowick at dawn. Wow, they're selling so much crap. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Did I not repair everything yet? Hmm. Let's see, maybe there's someone very impressive like Fisher, Taylor, Fisherman, Fisherman. Nope. Oh, wait, did they have ember shards? They got fish. I still have fish. I don't really need more fish. Is there something that I'm not repairing at the moment that I still... Yes, these two. Oh, don't worry about it. I don't feel as though you interrupted at all. Besides, there's nothing going on on the road. And my guys are sick. Okay, weaponsmith. See here, we can do something with this. This will actually work for me. Let's first check out the marketplace. Oh, I... Did I...? Hmm, was it another town? Hmm, maybe. I'm still going to sell them here, though. Let's get some actual armor, though, because helmets... Well, our helmets are not the greatest. But we definitely could do with some better gear. Uh, that's a little bit too expensive for my liking. 30. Oh my goodness, this thing is expensive. Mill Halberg. Mill Halberg. Hmm, okay. They look different, but they do the same thing. Reinforced mail armor, scale armor, basic mail shirts. Hmm. Let's uh, get both of these, and we'll give them some good helmets as well. Both of these, maybe. One thirty, two hundred. Whoa, two fifty. Oh my goodness, this is really expensive stuff, though. They have a good one in the marketplace as well. They did. Okay, so. Petted nasal helmet. Let's get the other one as well from the blacksmith armorer. Okay. And then some better weapons. Ooh, hold on. They got Fletcher here. 
Ooh, crossbows. I remember you saying something about crossbows the other time. Let's get some ammunition in that case and let's get ourselves two crossbows. And I guess that does mean that we're going to sell most of these. I'll hold on to the rest of these. Still got a fair amount of coin. Whoa, weapons are really expensive. I already got falchions, don't I? Righty then. So my frontline troops. Let's put this in the correct order. You two are going to get crossbows. Range on these things is six, and that one was seven. So it's the same range as a short bow. 40 to 60, 30 to 50. Okay, damage is better. And then we're going to give you a new helmet. And the same goes for you. And you're both going to get some better armor as well. You're my hound master, so I'm not going to give you a new one. I am going to give you something better though. 140, I think you got the best helmet I got. And the armor is 80. Which apparently also is the best armor that I got. How about you, 49? You're not very good at hitting stuff. He's pretty good. Let's give you some better gear then. 140. Uh, right. 90. Oh, okay, you're already carrying. I'm probably gonna give the rest of the gear to you then. Yep, yeah, you're gonna give. Get the padded leather. And, um. Hold on a minute. You need a better helmet. Let's give you that one. I need to be careful. This one and this one. These two are my hound bastards. Don't they automatically get bolts because I got munitions? Do I actually need to get quivers full of bolts? Because yeah, that would be stupid, wouldn't it? Or extra quivers at least. Yeah, I need to remove these at the very least. Um, lower, please. I'll just get some extra quivers. Bolt cases, whichever. Still got a nice little helmet here that you're going to wear. So you're left with the 45, which is still the highest. And I think they all got decent armor as well now. The 55. Yeah, we're looking alright. We seem to be looking alright at least. I might actually give one of the arches a. Uh, a hound as well. Oh, he is actually complaining that he doesn't have munition, so let's just go ahead and get these. Hmm, strange. Uh, he's still complaining that he's got no munitions. Did I get the wrong ones? Quiver of bolts. Crossbow. Um, I feel as though I'm missing something. You know what? I'm sure I'll find out eventually. Maybe it only resets once you leave a town. No, he's still complaining that he's got no ammunition. But I got ammunition. What are you complaining about, man? What, top right? What, in the town? We need to go back into the town. Uh, hold on, we're going to go to Meyerwick here. We'll check it there. Oh, this one! 
Oh my god, yeah, okay. Right. That's why they're complaining about not having munitions. Okay, I get it now. Yeah, that works. Right, because these are the extra items and these are the actual... Yeah, you can even see them on their back. Right, got it now. Thank you. Thank you for helping me to point that out, because that would have been kind of silly. Contracts. While you wait for Earhart, the steward, to explain what he needs your services for, you contemplate on how silent and eerie the whole settlement was when you first arrived. Earhart, the steward, raises his voice. This place is cursed by the gods and haunted by unearthly beasts. They come in the night with glowing red eyes, okay, and take lives at their whim. Most of our cattle is dead, and I fear that once there are no more, we are next to be torn apart. The other day we sent out our strongest lad out to find and kill the beasts, but we haven't heard of them since. He sighs deeply. Follow the tracks and hunt down and kill those creatures, so that we can live in peace again. We are not wealthy, but all chipped in to pay for your services. What is Myowick prepared to pay? You look able, so I'm willing to pay quite a bit. You are to receive 210 crowns in advance, and another 320 when the job is done. I want more upon completion. This is it, then. You are to receive 180 crowns in advance, and another 350 when the job is done. Sure, whatever. We'll, we'll take it. I accept your offer. We will accept this contract. Where do we need to go to? Does it actually... Do I just need to wait? One down with terrorizers. I probably need to wait here then. Let's set up camp. We got enough food. Let's go ahead and do that. Camp. T. They do come at night. But shouldn't I be able to... Oh, along the way. A peasant comes to you... Comes up to you uh, with his clothes in shreds. Uh, shredded rags about him. With fair modesty, he's got... His hands covered his groin. Okay, nice. Please, sirs, come and take a look at this horror. Uh, I, I'm not sure I want to. When you question what he's talking about, he throws his head up, thrusting his hips at you. What? He turns a foot like a puppet spun about and takes off running, hooting and hollering. A woman walks up to you in the wake of the man's madness. She's got her hands against her bosom. He's gone mad on account of his brother being torn apart by the beasts. You turn to her, half expecting the lady to rip off her clothes and wobble at her shapes in whatever direction she pleases. Instead, she simply stares at you. I know Mayawick has hired some men to take care of these beasts, and you certainly look the part of a hired hand. Please, sir, protect us from these evils and the evils that they spread. We move on. Do I actually need to go somewhere now? No, it, it, it doesn't say I need to go somewhere. I'll just, we'll, we're just going to stay here. We're still encamped. Surely these beasts are... Are they about, maybe? Let's just check the surrounding area. My guys are still sick, though. I'm not happy with that. Where, oh, where are these beasts coming from? I guess the forest would be a good place for them, but I see no tracks. Couldn't I instead have followed that guy that was acting all weirdy? All weirdly and awkward and... Uh, I don't think this is going to work for me. We're going to go back to my wick and just camp near the town. I think that's the better idea. Food-wise, we're still more than fine. Let's uh, camp here. 
Just outside of town, actually. Let's do that. Oh no, the town is on fire. There's a tiny little fire here. Oh, it's oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What the? Dire wolves. Get the men some dire wolves. Whoa, these things are fast. It's only four of them. Famous last words. Oh, he looks very weird. They're still just dire wolves. Uh, right, 24. We're not going to fire him. We're not going to fire him. One of these two, then. He looks proper disgusting. Oh, my goodness, really. And then I need to reload for 7 AP. Okay, so shots are inexpensive to make, but everything else, that's kind of, yeah. Reloading takes a lot of time, but shooting is very easy to do. Spear wall! Shield wall! You can't actually do an aimed shot. Wow. <laughs> wow. Uh, we're going to have to destroy this one, though. Oh, that's no good. Hmm. Do I want to move forward? Can I go over here and then... No, I don't have anything left to move in, then. Hmm. I think we're going to go ahead and shield wall up. Shield wall! Spear wall! Shield wall! Here we go! Whoa, okay. They move and then still attack. Multiple times! Ouch! Ooh! And apparently they're not stupid. I'm not sure how happy I am with that. Oh, come on now! Things are not looking so great at the moment, guys. Come on! Uh, 20... Yeah, I don't really think this is going to be a very good idea. Oh, but I can move over here and then shoot, right? Ah! Well, it's wavering. For all the good that does me. I'll move you over here. Ah. Come on already, just hit it! It's really hard to hit these things, apparently. Especially when you're sick. Ooh. Oh, crap. We're not looking so great. Ah, this is even giving him cover as well. Go on, kill it! Come on, this one is fleeing. Okay, good. Let's sit. Oh, crap, I forgot about that. That was stupid. I don't quite get why I only get one attack with these things. Probably need to check that out. Um. Oh, and he's still gonna. Oh man! Shouldn't this one be fleeing? Oh no, he's about to break, but he's not quite breaking yet. Uh, no. 
Oh, for the love of... Okay, nearly got that one. I can't even throw up my shield wall now. Oh, I'm too fatigued apparently. Am I? Oh, okay, apparently I am. Oh, but this one is fleeing as well now. We should be alright. Good one. And that one's going to flee as well. Well done, lads. And that three of them, no, four, five of them leveled up. Wow. And we gained some pelts. Unusually large wolf pelts. Okay, these weapons I'm carrying, they're not the best. So, let's go ahead and switch those out. I've still got a few extra spears. Come to think of it, I might actually give... Throw that over here. Pull arm. Give you a dagger. We'll uh, give you a pull arm. Oh, actually, no, let's not do that. Let's not do that. How about I give you a poor arm? Let's give you a poor arm. And then you can take this and that. In case I need to switch it out. And you're going to get a short sword. And the same goes for you. And then we just got normal weapons that will allow us to hit them twice. I have no luck with the ranged troops. No, my archers have always been horrible. Except for last time, when the orcs nearly killed me and my archers finally, uh, well, kind of won us the battle. Barely, but still. Which perk are you going to take, my friend? I like Sundering Strikes. Let's go with that. You get Sundering Strikes as well. You're gonna get Sundering Strikes as well, apparently. How about I'm gonna up these two for you? That's probably better. Sundering Strikes, please! More Sundering Strikes. Hmm, I need to increase that. Should I go ahead and increase the rest of your defense? Yeah, sure, let's do that. Hmm. This is not great. Let's increase your resolve then, and uh, your defense against range. Oh, and uh, Sundry Strikes, please. Right, let's collect our... Wait, that's not everything? Oh, it is, okay. Having killed the foul creatures, you begin skinning and scalping them. Grugsome creatures require grugsome evidence. Your employer, Erhard Stewart, might not believe your work here otherwise. He'd be a fool not to believe me. Erhard Stewart sitting at his table, legs up over a corner. His eyes are staring at the ceiling, the corners of his face pinched with wilted folds. Uh, with his folds. He looks at you. Welcome back. I've been getting word of your doings, of your battles with the monsters. You nod, looking around for your reward. The man shows you the door. Wait, what? Dietrich, a fellow con councilman of Mayowick, has your payment outside. 350 crowns is agreed upon, and the people of Mayowick fear you, though they may, are blessed all the same by your arrival here. Thank you, mercenary. Ah, we got another contra. Ooh, messenger greets you. He names himself as someone forgettable. Okay, but then we shall forget about you quickly. Hey, Blue. How are you doing, mate? Because you instantly forget his name. <laughs> However, 
His information is quite important. A local nobleman has requested your audience. Let's talk business. Sir Lambert von Perrowing is rolling a scroll as he explains his predicament. A dispute amongst the nobility has me short on good fighting men. Unfortunately, a band of greenskins have chosen this exact moment to come into these parts. They're camping southeast of here. You know what? Greenskins it probably means orcs. Not worth it. No Surrey Bob. No Surrey Bob. Let's go to Glansburg. Need to get some new provisions as well. What have we got? We got some grain, we got some let's get some meat. Are my guys still sick actually? They are. Struck with sickness and disease, this character isn't feeling well at all and hardly in a condition to fight. If the fever doesn't take him, he'll probably pass in time. Uh, it'll probably pass in time. Okay, so can I somehow do something about that? Other than keep stocked on the supplies? Let's get them some beer as well. Hmm. I wouldn't want to lose these guys. Seriously, this is worth 200 and I'm getting less than 50 per pelt for it. Are you kidding me? You stupid peasants. I'll hold on to those. Uh, these are slightly better. So we're gonna... This one is as good as that one. We're gonna sell the really crappy ones. Feral shield. I probably should sell these as well. Let's do that. And we're going to sell the orc weapons because they've not really been working out for me well. Hold on a sec. Didn't one of the guys lose his helmet? Oh yeah, he did. Right. Uh, here, have a cap. Might actually get something other for you. Oh, we could give you... Yeah, let's give you that instead. See, that looks good on you. Even with your uh, face in its current condition. I, th I think we're alright over here. Let's uh, move on down. There should be some more tasks waiting for us over there. All the way down in Weissenhaven. First, Suchanza Company. Is that 23? Does that mean how many men they have? Or how powerful the group is. Because those wolves had a rating of full. Oh. Oh, Orc Berserkers. Yeah, you know what? That's probably worse than uh, how many? Oh, you can't see it from over here. Okay, never mind then. What did it say outside all on? The relations, the neutral relations of the town are open and the faction relations are neutral. Hmm. First though, let's uh, get the company some rounds. Oh, Ruthar the learner is now drunk. And apparently it does not raise his spirits even though he's drunk or does that do both? It doesn't say. Hmm. Let's see about this contract. Oliver Weisenhaven looks out his window. We both know that bandits and the gods know what else are terrorizing these parts. And they all are quite fond of the roads. No, no they're not. Because I've been traveling the roads and I haven't come across anything. After a particularly bad run, my old caravan guards lost the heart for the job. Now I need someone else to watch my shipment. Next one out is going to Donnerstadt. Does that sound like a place you'd like to be paid to go to? Uh, can I check where that is? Let's talk money. Rest assured that what I'm offering you now is a fine price for your work. You'll be paid 1,010 crowns when the contract is done. That probably means it's on the other side of the damn country again. I want more on completion. No, you're already getting more than you're worth. It's 
1,010 crowns when the contract is done. No, I want more on completion. Fair. Would you accept this instead? No, I want more on completion. Very well. Given your demands, I offer you this. You are to receive 1,160 crowns when the contract is done. Now, see, this is kind of tempting. Uh, you know what? I will accept your offer. And that uh, means that we're going to... I've got six days' worth of provisions. I can't buy anything, so we'll probably... Yeah, there we go. Where is the hell's Donna stat? It's probably on the other side of the... Yeah, it's all the way over there again. Ugh. Oh, well. Last time I've done this, this was a free ride at, up north and then back up south. And I really wish you could stop in between. Oh, you can! You can actually stop in between. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, but we're going to move on. Can I actually move the caravan? No, I can't move the caravan. I just need to select the town as soon as we're in. Oh, not through the bog again. I forgot about that. My men are already sick. Uh. Nobody dare get sick even worse. <laughs> the band is running out. They're like, no, I don't want to fight you. Get away. Ooh, orcs. Three orcs? No, oh, they're still in front of us. But they don't want to mess with us. Ooh, look at this. Are these fighting together? Against the peasants? Oh no, goblins are actually hostile against orcs as well. Nice. Are we nearing a town again? Not really. No, I've still got enough food. Ah, here we go. Saxdorf. Sackdorf. Sackdorf. So, uh, we're gonna... Yeah, there we go. Oh, but yeah, it's evening again, so that's not gonna work. Let's just move along then. And there's Donnerstadt already. Ooh, direwolves. Are they coming after us? No. Reaching Donnerstadt, the caravan leader strikes up a conversation as if the two, if you two might have something in common. Well, we did share the road. He talks of his younger days when he was a spry young man who could have done this or that. He apparently missed out on a lot of fighting. What a shame. Bored with his talk, you ask the man to pay you so you can get out of this wretched place. Is there anything of interest in here? Uh, weaponsmith, and there's a contract. And some fur pelts. And apparently, my hides are even less valuable up here. Yeah. Oh well. Anything good in here that I. Ooh, that looks fancy. Masterwork slicer. Ooh, fancy looking. What's this contract about? As you enter Volmar, the wise's room, he and one of his servants are nailing a, a box shut. Good seeing you, sellsword. One moment, please. No, idiot. Hold the nail that way. I know I hit your thumb before, but I won't do it again. I promise. <laughs> no, he does. He's, he's evil. He wants you to hold it that way. He's going to hit you again. His servant reluctantly holds the nail up by the man's hammer. Uh, by the man. Uh, 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 holds a nail up by the man hammers it home. Yeah, okay, never mind. Finished. He wipes the sweat of his brow and looks to you. I need this here crate to deliver to... No, 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 no. No, we're not delivering anything anymore. You can go and deliver it yourself. We're going to go to Sextor. There's some direwolves around here, I'm thinking. Did they move along or... There's a lot of movement around. Here they go. There's five of them. 
Ooh, they're, they're fighting the Donnerstadt militia. Can we join that fight? Engage! Yes. Yeah, why is this all dark? Oh, I'm not sure. Did I join the... I, I don't think I joined the fight. Strangely enough. Got some high ground here. That's where we're going to set up the arches. Crossbowmen, which, whichever. Bolt throwing dudes. Uh, you're my... Swords guy. Alright, let's uh, move you over there. I'm sh These are stupid creatures. They should be coming right at me. I hope. Formation! Okay, these are the slowest wolves in the history of wolves. Wolf, wolfies. Well, I, I, I think I can hear them, but where the hell are they? Move up the line! Can I see any of them? No, no I can't. They're not over there either. <laughs> Hunt them down in broken formation. Worst idea ever. Yeah, well, I can hear them, but I can't see them. Well, that's not the worst formation. But they're definitely not coming to me. No, not over there either. Ah, there's one. And then the rest of them are probably right behind that one. Hmm. Or possibly not. I don't want you over there. Let's uh, move you up on the flank. It still gets to attack. Damn, these things are fast. Can I... Oh, I can't even hit it from over here. Hmm. Let's move you over here. Let's surround this wolf. That's an okay-ish hit. Where the hell are the rest of them? Yeah, he's not looking so great. Yeah, let's not do that. One down. A gazillion to go. Oh, there's another one over there. Man, these things are far. Oh, here's the rest of them. Ah, there's still one well out of range. Probably should move up, though. If I move over here, can I hit them? I can hit this one. Ah, good hit. Well done. Come on, destroy that beast. Um, do I want to have you over there? Maybe not. Let's move you here and form spear wall. You can't hit that others. 
That's a good one. Oh, this is actually not great, come to think of it, that he's over there. Sixty-six. And he misses. Of course he does. Why wouldn't he? Oh, ouch. Ouch. Again, the same guy is getting clobbered. Uh, let's not do that. All of this is, is... Yeah, it's all bad ideas. Let's not do that. Uh, you need to step in. This wolf is already not looking so toasty. Come on, this one needs to go. There you go. And, uh, oh, right. Yes, okay. And you still need to reload. And, um, well, I'll move down there, I guess. That one's about to run. Turn tail and run. Good hits. Good hits. Hmm. Oh, that one's about to turn as well. He gets cut down. And there goes another. Oh, this is the final one. Hmm. No need for bolt throws in that case. Or, uh. Bolt. But. Uh, arbalests. That's the one I'm looking for. Arbalests. <laughs> eh, easy enough. Yay, more hides! Which aren't worth as much as I would want them to be. And my guys are still all sick. Most of them. Ooh, the contracts. And a tavern. From where we shall get some more bread. And grain. And berries. Berries are good as well. Ah, uh, 40. These hides are not worth a lot. You enter Suxdorf and a man immediately approaches, trundling through the mud to get to you. He announces himself as someone in the employee of Arnulf the steward, a man of some power in this town, and he, along with the thoughts of monies and others, have decided of monies and uh uh, have decided to seek your services. I am all ears. As you settle into the room, Arnulf, the steward, finishes a goblet of Cobra wine. Okay, and heaves the cup out a window. What an odd fella. You hear the dim of it, uh, the din of it clattering hollow far, far away. He turns to you. While walking the roads, bandits swarmed my wagon and made off with all my goods. They left me my life which is fine but the gal of it of what they did keeps me up at night i see their sneering faces hear their laughter i believe it was a message to go after me because i refused to pay their tolls well now i'm ready to pay a toll you see sellsword if you go and slaughter these vagabonds i'll pay a tidy toll indeed what say you Apparently it's only a one skull contract. How much are you going to pay me then? 710 crowns when the job is done. No, 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 no. We want more. Who do you think you are? No way I am increasing the offer. You'll be paid 710 crowns when the contract is... Okay, okay, we'll do it then. Sheesh. Where do we need to go to? Oh, it's right in the... Oh, it's in the forest. Crap. 
That's not good. A few bandit raiders, some bandit thugs. While spy on the bandits, you count about ten men moving about. You spot a figure you did not at all expect. Rotor Raven's Black, the infamous robber Baron. The man's bodyguard detail must be inspecting the state of the camp. What luck! If you take his head back to your employer, you might just earn yourself a little bonus. Prepare to attack! So now there's a bandit leader as well. Hmm. Well, let's see how that goes. Oh, we are actually in formation though. Is this him? No. Thug, thug, raider, raider. Uh, we got a little bit of high ground here. Which we will make use of. They're not the fastest men. Is that him? Can't tell. This is probably him. Yeah, that is him. He moved forward and then he moved back. He was like, oh no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. We're not doing that. What an odd fella. Um, we're going to set up the... I'm going to put one up here and then the rest of these guys are... Oh, I can't actually... Hmm. Why can I not move through these two? Okay, hold on then. We'll move you last. I'll set you up over... We can actually move you over here. Uh, let's move you here then. And then wait. You get to uh, not do an awful lot, apparently. Right. So this clearing... You get to go over there. You get to close that gap though they are coming this way quite rapidly all right move on to die ground Fire at will. Uh, fire at this guy. Oh, good hit. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We want to see more of that. They're coming up on all sides. Let's hope that Baron is coming up as well because right now I think he's trying to turn tail. I kind of like this line I got going here. Might actually move you over. Mm, nah, that's probably not the best idea. Let's set you guys up for uh, a shield wall. Thirty. Hmm. Oh, because right, yeah, because this guy's in front of me. Oh, we're still gonna try it. Oh, oh nearly got him. He's breaking. Shield wall! Shield wall! Form the shield wall, man! Uh, you can't form shield wall. Hmm. Uh, shield wall and spear wall. Shield wall! Spear wall and shield wall. Alright, we're ready for them. Who are we going to kill now? Oh, this guy doesn't look so great either. Oh, he's got a buckler. Ah, we missed. Oh, he's coming up again. This guy looks terrible. Good hit. Oh, another one. And another one. They got no chance. They're not getting in. Go on then, try it again. Oh, you missed him. 
You horrible, horrible guy. Oh, no you don't. Shield wall! Kind of feels as though he's not going to be doing an awful lot, though. But let's uh, keep up the shield wall. Reload! Oh, I can't believe you missed that. There we go. One down. A lot more to go. Good hit. Put up that shield again, guy. Put it up. No, I can't do it again. Oh, okay. That's uh, hmm, painful. Yeah, hey, you can't do it again either. Oh. Hmm. Reload. And f 72. Oh, good hit. Oh, we're being... He's, oh, he's not in a good spot. He holds up his shield as well. Is he still to go? No, oh, they've... They're both done. 46. Oh, my goodness. You're horrible. And useless. Horribly useless. Is the big guy hiding? Oh, come on now. I can't actually hit my own guy with this. I can't? Hmm. That's uh, weird. Good hit. Come on, kill him. Almost. Nicely done. Yeah, he's breaking. Seriously, need to get some kills here. That oh, ho, ho, off with his head. Oh, and he nearly kills him with one stroke as well. Oh my goodness. They're doing so good. They're doing all sorts of good. Apparently my spear guys are really getting tired. Let's uh, hold formation, man. Hold formation. Whoa, what the? He's throwing axes at me? Damn him. Damn him. For that, you will die 5%. Ah, uh, okay, maybe you will not die for that. Oh, ho, ho, and he's going to break. And you miss again. You are terrible at that. He's trying to run. And he dies like the coward he is. Come on, it's 68, man. There you go. Alright, step in. Finish off this bandit thug. It really is 5%. It's horrible. I'm just going to put it out there. It's horrible. Okay, hold position then. And he dies as well. Like the dog that he is. Apparently it's uh, quite difficult to move up in this terrain. Can I? Nope, can't get over there. Close the distance. Get him surrounded. Come on, kill this guy. Oh, I can't. Damn it. Oh! The hell? Come on. Finish him off. He's bleeding. Uh, you guys are not going to be doing awful, are you? You're just going to be set up there. That's what I'm thinking. Hmm. It's not perfect, but it doesn't really have to be. I could knock him back, but that's probably a horrible idea. Why can I not throw up a shield ball anymore? Hmm. Okay, this is... Uh, old brick is not looking so great right now. Absolutely not looking so great. Can I hit this guy? I can't even hit him. Nah. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Oh, uh, please don't kill him. 
Oh, he kills him. But a dog. The dog avenges his master. Still, it's a shame that the guy died. Oh, he's actually wavering. Hmm. Can I, uh... Come on, we can do this. Uh, or not. I'm not really sure what the dog is going to do, but... Hmm? Oh my goodness, he hasn't hit a single time! Ah, <laughs> you missed me. And you are the leader of bandits. Come on, get those hits in. Finish him off. Preferably somewhere today. Oh, they're getting very tired now, apparently. Oh, there we go. Nope, misses him again. Oh, okay. Have at ye. My God, my guy just can't hit him. 29. 48. There you go. 56. Dog's just sat there. It's like, uh, that's alright. Don't really need to do anything. Is he finally 50? Nope, still misses. Are we gonna. No, we're not gonna do that. I can actually... Uh, let's just do it like this, I guess. Uh, no. They're too tired to even throw up a shield ball now. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna have to do something. Let's move in these uh, arbalests. gonna be like that, are ya? Come on, man. They're really tired. 64. Oh, he misses. 72. Almost. Almost, but not quite yet. Can I... I can move over here, but I can't really... Well, no. Let's, let's not do that. Let's move you over here. 68. He finally hits him. This is going to be enough, though. <coughs> oh. Oh, he's bleeding. And he dies. The scumbag. Oh, he had a really nice Rotor's Raven Black Cleaver. And we retrieved our dog. We got some Ember Shards as well. And uh, some decent armor. Mail coil. Oh, good helmets. Okay, well, we lost a guy, but we gained some good gear there. And uh, some good treasure as well. Rotor Raven Black lies dead at your feet. You turn the body over and straighten out the neck, giving your sword a better target. It takes two good cuts to remove the head, which you quickly put into a meal sack. We move out. And next time... We will collect our pay. Oh, although not quite. While talking to Rudgard the Learner, a loud yell draws your attention. You look up the road to see a mob of men standing in your way. They got all manner of weaponry and armor. Their ringleader steps forward, announcing that they are famed bounty hunters. We only wish to have the head of Rotor Raven's Black. I don't think so. You shrug. We killed the man. We're collecting on this head. Now get out of the way. When you take one step forward, the bounty hunter raises their weapons. Their leader takes one step towards you. 
there's a choice to be made here and could get a lot of good men killed. I know it isn't easy, but I do suggest you think it over very carefully. Well, you'll have to pay with blood if you want it so badly. But this is this is them. They look to be fairly well armed, but can I still fire up here? I can fire up here. We're we gonna kill their dog. I can't actually kill their dog. Yeah, they got pretty decent. Okay, I missed that. That's horrible. And he moves straight in. Okay, that's not great either. They're very quick. They are very quick. Can I kill this dog? Well, if I had hit it, I might have killed it. Uh, and now we're sort of not in a great position. Who are we going to fire at? Oh my god. Oh, I should have reloaded. Damn it. Uh, we're going to release the hound. Let's just get in there. Kill the dog. There you go. Hmm. Maybe I should uh, have an actual look at my hit percentages. Okay, that's a good one. <laughs> get it. Oh, he's netting me. Probably should uh, change weapons for you. Oh, I wish I had a shield now. There's a minus 15 chance to hit. Probably gonna lose a dog here. Oh, it's funny that he's actually netting him. Because I don't really want him to move anywhere. Not yet, at least. Let's move him over there. Oh, they really don't like the dog. Such a nice, nice dog. Good hit. Reload. And fire! Oh, good hit. Yes, thank you very much. 16! Are you kidding me? Yeah, that's... Oh, I can repel him. Yeah, I didn't really expect that to do anything. 20%. That's a shield bash. 25, not great. Let's put up the shield wall. Come on, break that net already. There you go. That's an okay one. And that's an okay one as well. 62. Come on, let's see about killing off as many of them as soon as possible. This guy's really bad. He's got a lot of armor on. Come on, we nearly got the first one. There you go. Oh, ouch. Then the dog gets killed as well. What the? Oh, 10% and I actually kill him. That's an okay one. Oh, nice, but actually that's not the best thing that I could have done, I guess. Nope, missed him. Come on, guys. Come on. Ooh, I should take the high ground here. Ah. Painful. Hey, you're going to stay in reserve. I'm not going to move you up just yet. He's nearly gone. Although, nearly is probably a little bit of a... Not really true. Oh, that is a good one. Oh, we actually killed him! Okay, that wasn't as difficult as I thought it would be. Seventy-six! Nearly got him. 
Can he finish it? 85. Yes, he can. Die, bounty hunters. Uh, okay gear, I guess. Not even carrying provisions or loads of gold or anything. Okay, that this is where we will leave it. Easy company. We'll continue another day. And we are going to head on over to Fratchit's 